two. Well, let's bring in this fella here from Kiwaton, Ontario. Here's Jeff Gustafson. One of only two Canadians to ever win an Elite Series event. He happened to win it right here in Knoxville, Tennessee. Absolutely dominated that event, went wire to wire. All small mo did something that many said couldn't happen. Can lightning strike twice? The great Canadian snow leopard, Jeff Gustafson, double guns loaded, bang, bang. Gussie shoots out the lights on day number one. What a day, what a fishery, and what an angler. Literally did something the last time we were here that many said could not happen. And there's many who said it can't happen this time around, but we are one day in. And look, oh boy, somebody went to Piggly Wiggly and came back with a whole sack full, ladies and gentlemen. Five fish, need 17 pounds, eight ounces to take the lead. 18 pounds, eight ounces, and the great Canadian Snow Leopard is leading the Bassmaster Classic. Your Academy Daily Leader, Jeff Gustafson, the biggest bag of the day, and he is leading the biggest tournament in professional bass fishing. Eighteen pounds and eight ounces. Wow. Eighteen pounds, eight ounces. You are leading this tournament. Is that good? Is that good? <laughs> Man, from the beginning of this, even watching you alive today, you know, you caught one and you're like, 14 more to go. You, you have laid your line on, if you're going to win this tournament, you're going to win it your way. And you are catching them in a way that you are one of the best in the world at doing it. And to do this, to have given the candy to all the children, everybody saw, you, when he won, people were like, but the classic's gonna come back here one day, and now he just showed everybody. But you just showed everybody, you know how to handle the candy a little better than the rest of them. Uh, yeah, I found another spot or two. So, um, you know, it worked out today. I don't have a lot of places, but, um, but I, I, I started this morning where I caught them last time. There's some fish there, but it, they're hard to catch. I, I lost. I don't know if anyone was watching, I lost a nice one. I tried to boat flip it on a small hook. I shouldn't have done that. Um, but went to the next spot and settled down and, and made it happen. And, uh, you, you know, I'm excited to go again tomorrow. Um, I, got, I got some good stuff, but you, you just never know with these things, whether they move or, you know, I found them on Sunday and um, they were still there today. So hopefully, we, you know, we get a little more out of it. Ten more. Ten more. Ten more. Would love to see it happen for you. These are all the Aussies that are down here. You guys are awesome. You came a long way. Love you guys. And all my Canadians up here. I got lots of friends and love Knoxville. Love the classic. Love you, Mercer. <laughs> Let's go. It's not over yet, but man, you have started great. And you guys, the Canadians kind of compete against each other. How bad would you love to become the I mean, you're the second Canadian to win the lead, which is an incredible. I mean, the second of a whole country. But there's only firsts, or very rare, to become the first Canadian to ever win the Bassmaster Classic. Well, there, there's a long way to go for that to happen. Um, but, you know, it feels awesome to be in good shape after day one and um, survive the first day. But, yeah, I, I hate hearing, um, you know, the second Canadian, uh, you know. And, uh, and I love beating Corey. So... Yeah, I, I'm, I'm happy. I'm a happy dude right now. Happy to have you here. Let's hear it for the great Canadian snow leopard, Gussie, leading the Academy Sports and Outdoors Bassmaster Classic presented by Toyota.